Hello and welcome to another of Creative Block's two minute tool skill videos. Today we're going to be looking at Photoshop and specifically the custom shape tool. The tool can be found in the tools panel over here alongside the other shape tools and once selected you can choose from a huge range of different shapes up here in the drop down menu. So you can see I've just chosen a simple arrow but we can choose from lots of other arrows and also access many many more shapes using these different settings down here in the flyout menu. And you can see we have lots of different options up here in the options bar that allow us to customize how our shape looks. Now when we're ready to draw a shape we can simply click and drag to begin it within our image. There are a few keyboard shortcuts that can really help us out while we're dragging our shape. I can hold alt and that will make my shape work outwards from a center point like that. If I hold shift it will constrain the proportion so I'm holding shift and alt now which will draw my shape from the center point and also constrain the proportions and I can also hold the space bar and that will allow me to temporarily reposition the shape while dragging and once we finish dragging our shape you can see it appears in the layers panel here as a separate shape layer which means it's completely editable on its own now let's fill it with a color by going to the fill options here and we can choose any of these different colors here let's go for a light blue we can also double click the thumbnail here to access a similar color picker and choose from more colors like that. We can also choose different stroke options to affect the outline of our shape. So if I just bring the stroke value upwards, you can see how we can get this dashed line effect. I can choose from different effects here so I can go for a dashed circular effect or a simple full line. And I can also choose from different colors again for my stroke. I can also tweak the width and the height with these settings here and I can choose from different path options here which become more useful when working with lots of different shapes on different shape layers and of course I can choose from more shapes in exactly the same way so perhaps let's load a different set let's go for objects and then we'll do a light bulb and bring that over here so you can see how it's very quick and easy to build up designs using these custom shapes and of course everything's fully editable so we can give our light bulb a different color and perhaps get rid of the stroke. So there we go that's how to use the custom shape tool in Photoshop.